We start with breaking news in the investigation into missing mother of five, Jennifer Dulos. Good evening, everybody, and thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Mark Zinni. And I'm Denise Desenzo. We've learned the girlfriend of Fotis Dulos, Jennifer's estranged husband, met with investigators and the state's attorney this afternoon. So the girlfriend who's under arrest met with state police as you see them walk in the offices there. Yeah, this is exclusive video right here for state police investigators and the state's attorney for Stanford and Norwalk are seen entering the law office representing Michelle Traconis, the girlfriend of Fotis Dulles. Uh, now we are told that they had audio and visual equipment used to take statements. The state's attorney office is prosecuting the case and supervising the entire investigation. And we just saw Michelle Traconis walk out of the law office with her mother getting in the car just there. Tonight, nearly two weeks missing, the search intensifies to find evidence in the case. And one of those searches takes us back to a Hartford trash plant where police have been digging through garbage for the past three days. Channel 3's Courtney Zeller has been covering this part of the story for and she's joining us live with more now on what she's been seeing today. Courtney. Well, Denise and Marcy, police have been out here since the beginning of the week, and today is no different. We've seen a lot of state police cars enter uh, this facility right behind me here. That is a trash facility here in Hartford. Now, police told us today that since Jennifer went missing, the public has been such a big help. Over 200 tips have poured into uh, New Canaan Police Department and nearly 70 residents have provided them with some sort of surveillance video. Now, you might remember, of course, earlier this week, like I mentioned, this all started when Connecticut State Police major crime squads geared up in hazmat suits and protective masks before they entered the trash to energy plant in Hartford, searching for evidence in the disappearance of 50-year-old Jennifer Dulos. Now, they've brought in police dogs as well. Sources telling us investigators have been working 12-hour days going through piles of trash. Now, it's the size of a football field. They're using their hands and other equipment to look for clues. On the day Jennifer disappeared, court documents show her estranged husband, Fotis Dulos, and his girlfriend, Michelle Traconas, were caught on video throwing items in garbage bins in 30 locations along Albany Avenue in Hartford. Court documents also reveal bloody clothing was found in those garbage bags. The blood was Jennifer's. Both were arrested in connection with this case for tampering with evidence. Now, Fotis remains in jail tonight. His girlfriend, as you saw in that video earlier, has bonded out. She bonded it out on Monday when they appeared in court. They are back in court on Tuesday. Now, police haven't said yet what was found here. We, of course, will be on this story. We'll bring you the latest developments once we get them. For now, we're live with the Mobile Newsroom in Hartford. Courtney Zeller, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.